Have you ever had a time when you need to come up with some kind of an appetizer or hors d'oeuvre or some kind of a snacky thing to take to an event and you're thinking, oh my gosh, I forgot all about it, what am I gonna do? Well, I keep a few ingredients on hand because it has happened to me more than once. And these few ingredients can be put together and make a wonderful, delicious snack or appetizer. And so what I've done is measured out about two cups of hummus. You can use your homemade hummus, you can use purchased hummus, just use whatever is your favorite. And I've chopped up a mix of olives, pitted the olives, chopped them up pretty fine. And then I chopped up some sun-dried tomatoes that were packed in oil. And I'm going to just layer those on a platter. So first I'm going to put my hummus and you can use whatever size platter you want, but I like this one just because it has a little bit of a shallow bowl in the middle of it. And just spread your hummus out. And then I'm going to sprinkle the olives over it. So you can see that there's a mix of colors here. There's Kalamata olives, there's some green olives, and I've probably got about half cup of olives here. And I'm really going to cover the top of my hummus with these olives. And you know olives are a little bit salty, so it, this adds the saltiness to this layered mixture. And then over that go the sun-dried tomatoes. And remember I said these sun-dried tomatoes were packed in oil, so they're soft and moist and they also have a little bit of seasoning on them. And just sprinkle that up. And already it looks kind of pretty, doesn't it? This is how I take it to my event. I'll just cover it with some plastic wrap and stick it in the refrigerator until it's time to go. In a separate little container, I'm going to bring some toasted pine nuts to just sprinkle over the top. Now, you don't need to have this, it's optional. Just do it when you feel like splurging a little bit. I took the pine nuts, put them in a small pan over medium heat and just kept stirring until they started to turn brown and then I dumped them onto a plate so that they would stop cooking right away. So transport these a little bit or in something separate. When you get to your event, take off the plastic wrap, sprinkle some pine nuts over the top, and then serve them with your favorite crackers or chips or maybe even some fresh veggies. And you've got a wonderful three-minute Mediterranean dip. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.